All right, what's up everybody? Quick tip, tools in action. Sometimes when you're wiring uh, remote control cars, vehicles, whatever, you work with multiple wires. You always want to have the cleanest job possible. So here I have three wires right here. So I'd like to tidy that up a little bit, make it nice, get it, get it, let it fit into a space. So uh, we're going to show you basically how you can make this into a really nice stranded single wire by using your drill. What we're going to do is you're going to take basically any drill. Here we have a 12 volt drill. Any drill will work. You're going to put the three wires into the chuck. You can even use a four volt drill as long as it spins. We're not doing any high torque applications here. We just basically want it to spin the wire. So what Eric's going to do, he now has the three wires tight in the end of the chuck. Obviously not because they just came out. So you want to make sure they're in there tight, which Eric will show you. He just likes to waste our time. Pretty much. So instead of this being a four minute video, now it's an eight minute video. Thanks to Eric's incompetency. There you go. Okay, so what he's going to do now, he's going to hold one end while he's going to pull the drill. Now, you don't want to go crazy here. You don't want to go too tight. You just want it till they're nicely wrapped up. And as you can see, it's wrapping up nicely. You'll feel when it gets uh, really tight because it'll start to want to get torquey on you. So right where he's about got it is good. And as you can see, the wire already wants to kink up. In situations where you're running with uh, heavier gauge wire, harder wire, non-stranded wire, you're going to want to use uh, electrical tape at certain points of the wire just to keep it all uh, in one place. So there you go. Nice, clean install job. Go ahead and check out toolsinaction.com for more... Uh, tips and don't forget to check out our Facebook and Twitter and our Power Tool Forum.